what's next. Angela is a high burst mage who can crowd control her enemies. She can hide in the brush, then use 2 1 ult to deal scary amounts of damage. Her skill 1 lets her unleash multiple small fireballs to deal damage. Her skill 2 lets her hurl a large fireball that stuns and slows enemies. And her ultimate is a powerful jet of flame that also gives her a shield. Level up the ultimate first, followed by skill 1 if the ultimate is not available. you live or let you die Dr. Bian is a mage hero with continuous poking abilities his basic combo 1 basic attack 2 basic attack ultimate allows him to rapidly reach max passive stacks and deal damage every skill and basic attack hit and every heal increase Dr. Bian's marks which deal damage to enemies and heal teammates his skill 1 throws a vial of poison at a target area that deals damage over time to enemies within range. His skill 2 deals damage to enemies and heals teammates within its path. His ultimate detonates all marks around him, dealing damage to enemies and healing teammates. In terms of skill learning for Dr. Beyond, prioritize his ultimate. If that is unavailable, prioritize skill 2. Diao Chan is a mage with powerful continuous damage output. Her basic 2 1 ultimate 2 1 combo deals considerable damage over time during teamfights. She places marks with every skill hit. At max stacks, the marks deal damage and restore health. Her skill 1 fires a spinning orb in the target direction, dealing damage. Her skill 2 is a forward dash that makes her untargetable while firing orbs that reduce cooldown when they hit. Her ultimate conjures a magic circle that grants her cooldown reduction while within it. In terms of skill learning, she should prioritize her ultimate. If unavailable, she should prioritize skill 1. The pinnacle of progress is to command both the natural and the artificial in harmony. Milady excels at clearing minion waves and taking down towers, and she can use her 2 1 ult 2 skill combo to crowd control enemies while dealing lots of damage. She relies on her mechanical minions to do her fighting for her, and she summons a new one each time she kills an enemy unit. Her skill 1 deals damage using an aircraft, while her skill 2 summons mechanical minions to attack enemy units and towers. Her ultimate stuns and marks the targeted enemy, and the mark deals extra damage when it expires. Prioritize upgrading her ultimate or her skill 1 if the ultimate is not available. Survival is the greatest challenge! Mozu is a mage with very powerful poking and crowd control abilities. His 1, basic attack, 2, ultimate skill combo can control the enemy when they least expect it. Mozu's 4th basic attack is enhanced to knock back enemies. With skill 1, he charges toward the enemy, and his next basic attack is enhanced. Skill 2 fires a mechanical cannon that stuns on hit. His ultimate releases mechanoids in all directions that crowd control enemies in a range. Prioritize the ultimate when learning skills. If it's not available, go for skill 2. We created civilization. We passed on civilization. Everything has happened before, as it will happen again. Nuwa's a mage with strong assist ability and burst damage. Her 3-2-1 ultimate combo provides rapid assistance to teammates and deals enough damage to wipe out enemies. Every time Nuwa upgrades, she gains more vision and range. When her skills hit, they place marks on enemies. Attacking marked enemies grants a movement speed boost and recovery. Her skill 1 releases energy, damaging and knocking back enemies in its path. Her skill 2 creates a matrix that halts enemies and deals explosion damage after a delay. Her skill 3 teleports her to a designated location and damages nearby enemies. Her ultimate's a super long-range energy blast that deals damage to enemies. 
In terms of skill learning, she should prioritize her ultimate. If unavailable, she should prioritize skill 1. My heart has been warmed. Princess Frost is a mage that has the power to freeze her enemies. In team fights, she can use skill 1 followed up by skill 2 and her own to let her teammates deal damage to frostbitten targets. Her passive enables her to fire three icicles every third basic attack. Her skill 1 slows enemies with crystals. Skill 2 freezes enemies caught in her circle of ice. And her ultimate summons a blizzard that deals continuous damage and slows targets. Prioritize upgrading the ultimate or skill 1 if the ultimate is not available. 